Hey Lim Pam fans, did you know that it takes 24 drawings to make one second for a cartoon? And this is a reaction video. Now a few nights ago I got um, a random message from someone on Discord asking me to give them feedback because they're now a YouTube animator. They're called Homie Donuts. So wait, I'm going to make, make a reaction video to them. So there's two videos on the channel and they're pretty short so I'm going to react to both of them. Alright, so we're going to start out with the first video he posted which is called My Experience Volunteering. Volunteering. Free oh, so the de this definition. And that's the thing we'll be talking about today. Okay. So recently there has been a survey at my school discussing a lot of health related things. Okay. One of them being volunteering as an activity, you know. And yeah, okay, I know. The results show that only a small portion of people, including me, actually volunteer in some way, shape, or form. Yeah. So, where am I actually Let's going with this? Money. That's just well, a fact. it all started one day in biology class, biology when our class, teacher hey. asked us if we would be willing to join the Gift for the Real Thing volunteering project, where we would stand in front of a store for four hours straight and give away leaflets to people to donate some edibles oh. for people in need. Okay, that's, that's now, nice. Now, I only try to help people out in any way, shape, or form, but four hours seem like a little bit too much to me. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm the same way. Okay, this seems like a win-win situation. Let's do this. I also got two of my friends. I like that animation of the mouth. That's nice. Go alone. And volunteering is actually quite intriguing. Of course, there are some people that are just straight up rude and can cause emotional. Karen's because you're not used to being criticized so much. But hey, some work ethic is always okay. good. So now we're going to move on to a second video, which is called "Why Coconut Suck." Now, I personally don't like coconuts, but I'm interested to know why he doesn't like them. So, I used to beg my mom to get me a coconut when I was younger, because there was always something so special about them. Our they look like hairy bowling balls. Conver our conversations would be something like this. Okay, I can't pronounce that word, but you get the point. Mom, can we get a coconut? Sure, honey. And we would never get one. It was probably because she didn't want to deal with sad. the shell, but still. You ruined my dreams, mom. But now I have my mom own money. I didn't know it didn't get from my parents. A little tight. And I can buy my own coconut. Oh yeah. Good job. I don't know why I said that. So I went to the store the other day and found the coconut. You can't see anything because my dumb fingers are poking out the camera. I also spent like 20 minutes searching for the barcode thingy, only to find out there's no barcode for coconuts. So thank you, employee, who told me that. Even though you could have told me that like 20 minutes ago. You should see how I chopped the shell off. Yeah. With an axe. The that you? process I don't was know. so freaking painful. Really I'm not even exaggerating. Either. I even got a cut from it. Okay, so here's some background info. I haven't done any research on how to actually eat the coconut before I got it. So once I peeled the coconut, I actually did do some research, and it turned out that it was either too okay. complex for me, or I just didn't have the patience to wait. So I just threw it in a blender. Oh yeah, and this is how it turned out. Looks like uh, ice cream that's melted. No. I no, 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 just no. So what, did we, so what did we learn in this video? I, yeah, I can't what we... speak like what the Coconut stays bad and you should always listen to your mom. <laughs> um, now I'm going to give you feedback. I think this show is pretty funny and the creator, I mean, Donut, is obviously very talented. But this is a channel in its early stages and that's kind of clear. Um, I mean, look at any YouTube channel, animation, whatever. My channel was pretty crap to begin with. I mean, we have to start somewhere, and I think um, these videos are pretty good for a beginner. They might sound a bit critical, but um, I, I think that you have a lot of potential to, to, to make amazing content. Just keep at it, and that, that's all, all I would say, because I think you're already doing really well. It kind of r reminds me of the good ones out or Janet Animations. And um, kind of like Grande Underrate, the way that you're kind of ranting about stuff. Like a really, really good channel. I would say the coconut video was probably better than the volunteer video, but this is my personal opinion. I think it'd be really cool to work with you. So um, let me know if you need someone to do a voiceover or something like that, and I'll be happy to record my voice and send it over to you. Check out Homie Donut over there, and I'll see you guys for another episode of Bloom Fans Reddit.